Wait. Are you sure you should continue? Maybe... Maybe we should leave things as they are. As you wish. At 6 a.m. this morning, a national curfew... Oh, hey, the good timeline where Hillary won the election. ...will be strictly controlled. The right to assembly is suspended. All electronic communications are restricted, and I have granted enhanced powers to our security agencies. In addition to these measures, all androids must be handed over to the authorities immediately. Temporary camps are being set up in all our major cities to contain and destroy them. I am now asking all civilians to cooperate with the authorities and rest assured that everything in our power is being done to guarantee the security of our nation. Please! Please! Wait, 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 wait. Who am I playing as? What? Am I playing as Hillary Clinton right now? What? Hacking, deviant leader, working, what? Worrying, hacking. Is it true that the androids could hack our IT systems, like nuclear power plants and military bases? All androids working on sensitive sites have been neutralized, and all IT systems have been suspended to avoid any risks of hacking. The situation is under control. Please! I'm playing as the crowd? Please. Deviant's intelligent life. Many believe that androids are a new form of intelligent life. Do you have any comment? That's ridiculous. Next question, please. Madam President. Okay, that's unfortunate. Please. Recall centers, Jericho Salt, public opinion. Some say these camps awaken painful memories from human history. How do you respond to that? That's absurd. There's absolutely no connection. Androids are not living beings. All we are doing is destroying defective machines. Please. Please. Army. Madam President, public opinion seems to have become increasingly favorable to the Deviants, particularly since they've adopted a peaceful approach. How do you feel about this? Public opinion is one thing, the security of the state is another. These Deviants are dangerous and This would be amazing if it was actually voiced by Hillary Clinton. <laughs> they actually got her to be part of the game. Please? Over here, please. Uh, Jericho Assault Army. Madam President! What's gonna happen to Cyberlife? Will androids be banned definitively? We're working very closely with Cyberlife to neutralize all deviants. I won't make any comments about anything else until we've dealt with the android question. Thank you. That will be all. Reporters. Always a joy to look at how they never understand the concept of that'll be all. Connor model 313-248-317. I'm expected. Identification successful. Okay. Go ahead. We got ourselves a spy. Ooh, that's a cool looking door wall thingy. Just keep on going. Now my question is, can we get Hank on our side? I don't know where he is right now, but if we could team up with him, then I got all my buddies together. Well, we still don't know where Luther is, but we're working on it, we're working on it. I did what I can, I didn't leave him behind. So now we just have to wait and see. That's a really pretty image right there. Oh boy. This place is clean. Follow me. 
We'll escort you. Thanks. But I know where to go. Maybe. But I have my orders. Follow the guard. Fine. Can I do anything else here? Probably not. If I don't follow the guard, am I going to get in trouble? Like, I haven't gotten in trouble for wandering before. I can't walk to the left. I was going to go examine that machine. I'll just lay low for now, I guess. Yeah, I'm still following you. Don't worry, buddy. I wish I had a run button, but I don't. Oh boy, this seems dangerous. And the thing is, Connor can't make other androids revolt, so... We have to get Marcus in here eventually. Okay, so we can talk to him. What would be awesome is if this was actually a giant stinking android and we could just have, like, some amazing, like, robot fight or something like that. Unfortunately, it's probably just a statue. How lame. Agent 54, level 31. Voice recognition validated. Access authorized. Neutralize the guard. Stop elevator before 31. What? Use panel. Pre-construct? What? What does that even mean? I'm gonna regret this. Oh, cool. I'm not gonna regret this. Uh, just think it through. Well, that didn't work. Simulation result. Failure. Go to the crotch. Good old crotch shot. Always works. I guess we'll execute it. Oh, I have to press buttons this time? Fine. Okay. Crotch shot, crotch shot, crotch shot. Oh, jeez. Use the circle, use the circle, use the circle of life. Oh! Turn around next shot, that was not good. Not good at all. Well, change the elevator then. Please indicate your identity and destination. Agent 54's voice, Connor's voice. Agent 54, level sub 49. Voice recognition validated. Access authorized. That was almost a doozy. Wait, what kind of elevator works like you could change the location mid-flight. That doesn't make sense. I guess it's the future. Whatever. The last boss leaves in 20 minutes. That doesn't give us much time. We've got to move fast. Oh, Kara, can you really get out of here in 20 minutes? Are you alright? I'm, I'm really cold. Deactivate? No! Wait. YK hot cold sensitivity activated. So I would just make it so she isn't cold anymore. That's a good thing. You'll feel better now. Thanks. Or am I gonna blow her? I just thought, like, is this gonna blow her cover? Like, they're gonna think she's not a human anymore? I really hope that's not what that means. Like, that should be a good thing. Like, you just pretend to be cold. They shouldn't- like, humans aren't that smart. Grab the gun. Could always use them. I know this is a crazy question, but do you think we could go to the department store real quick and give back the $40 we stole? Doubtful. Come on. Let's not stay here. What are we gonna do? 
We have to keep going if we want to catch that bus. Stay close to me. We're going to sneak past them without being noticed. We're going to make it, Alice, I promise you. Oh, jeez. Don't make promises that I don't have the capacity to keep because I'm bad at video games. Don't kill me! I didn't do anything! Shut up, I said! Are there many more? Hide low risk. That's our only option? We don't have to spend the night here. Freezing my nuts off. It's going to take weeks to get this fucking situation. We are far from Low risk. Just keep on going. I wish we could save them, but I think that will be an option. We need to be careful. This is high risk. Come on, get moving. Go over here. Hurry up, get in. I don't think we can save them. We just have to run for it. Just press X at the right times. Don't jump the gun. Look over there. It's Luther. Oh, of course it is. Ugh. Well, if we saved him once, we could save him again, right? Okay, let's go. I better not regret this. Hey, buddy. Low risk. This is a mistake. I'm human. I, I just want to go home. My wife is expecting me, and we're going to. Got orders to check all civilians. No! No! Please! I have a weapon. Fucking androids. Find a weapon? I don't- I already have a weapon! What are you talking about? Mind if I break you a question? Alice. She's hiding nearby. Kara, you saved us. We don't know how to thank you. Who are you again? No, before they see you. Oh, uh, yeah, sorry I couldn't save the other dude. Alice. Hopefully he wasn't important. Luther. I thought you were dead. Oh my god. I was afraid I'd never see you again. I wanted to meet you at the terminal, but they caught me along the way. Come on. We're close, but we don't have much time. High risk, okay, I'll just wait it out. Burger zone, anyone want a burger? I sure love some human burgers right now. Cause I'm a human. Oh Jesus, not that human. Go. Okay. Uh, oh God. High risk, high risk, high risk. Change the risk meter, please. Thank you. Okay. Okay, Alice, last chance. Do you want Burger King or nah? S say it now. Oh, that's why she would never eat anything, because she was a robot. Is that why? Is that our other hint that she was a robot? Okay, sure. Come on, low risk. Go. What, is there something else here? Brick, fine, sure. Wait, who is that? A checkpoint. We have passports, it should be okay, but you never know. Maybe we should take the detour and avoid the risk. We're almost out of time, we could miss the bus. Yeah, but it might be safer. Choose a route. Detour safer, checkpoint risky, three minutes. I don't know. What are our options? Last bus departs. It's the last bus. Reach the bus term terminal. Sneak past soldiers. Choose a route. Safer. It would take 11 minutes to get there. Checkpoint risky. Three minutes. And we have 17 minutes left. How many minutes do we have left? 
We have nine. We wouldn't make it. We have to go to the checkpoint. I took too long. I guess that's my fault. I don't like humans who carry guns. They make me nervous. Just stay calm, all right, Luther? Don't do anything until I say so. ID, please. Show them the ID. You do realize there's a curfew? Civilians aren't allowed out unless absolutely necessary. Where are you going? My daughter slept over at a friend's house. We went to pick her up. We're on our way home now. He suspects something. Stay calm. Everything is fine. You all right, little girl? She's trembling. Something wrong? She... She's cold. We really have to get her home fast. Sorry, miss, but we gotta be careful. There are deviants around, and our guys are nervous. You should hurry on home. Thanks. Hey, wait a minute. Oh, God. He knows, Kara. They're gonna kill us. Don't do anything, Luther. You hear me? They're gonna shoot. They're gonna kill Alice. You dropped this. Did you just give us a chocolate bar? You're welcome. Is that what that was? Or like, okay, Luther likes this more. I'm so glad I didn't regret that. Oh boy! We're coming to you live from Detroit where thousands of androids are marching through the city at this very moment. The leader of the Deviants, the one they call Marcus, is at the head of the march. Well, Miss Clinton, what are you going to do about it? Something's happening in Detroit, Madam President. Time to march. This is going to go poorly. Can't believe I kept Alice and Luther alive and everyone alive on that end. And we got a nice little breaking news thing. Not tacky in the slightest. Guess we're just gonna keep on going. Breaking news, the leader seems to be very awkward when he walks. He just likes to walk in circles and examine everything. Though he doesn't actually do anything. It's just amusing to watch. Home run. Is that the name of the team? Where are the home runs? It'd be funny if they were soccer players. Because everyone knows home runs belongs in football, right guys? I know my sports. So, that is a heck of a conversation to have when we're marching towards a execution camp. <sighs> Here we are. The moment of truth. It's a show that I really wish got renewed because it was really sinking good. don't have enough people. Oh god, this isn't gonna go well. We're gonna die. We're gonna die. I messed up. This is horrible. We messed up so badly. This isn't gonna work. Why did I do this? We don't want confrontation. We are protesting peacefully. I repeat, surrender now or we will open fire. There's no turning back now. This is genocide. You're killing millions of us. We demand the immediate liberation of all androids detained in camps. We're not leaving until you let our people go. Oh, 
I'm gonna regret. Oh god. Oh Jesus. Open fire on unarmed protesters? Hold your fire. Oh wow, it actually worked. Yes, Michael, we are less than a hundred meters away and events are unfolding as we speak. We will continue to bring you live updates. Joss Douglas, Channel 16. Michael, back to you. Marcus, what do we do now? We hold out. As long as we can. Oh boy. Stay sharp. Oh, there's a security camera here this entire time? Why didn't anyone tell me until now? Oh, and they're here to greet us. How wonderful. And I am Android. Uh, all of them? Mind if I corpse you a question? Circle X. Wombo combo! Convert androids. Do I have that power? I'm just gonna stop doing the L1 button because just goes back to that same dude. But then again, they all look the same actually. Did Marcus give us the gift? Wait, no, we talked with what's her face. She gave us the gift. Oh yeah, we were in business, baby. What? Step back, Connor. And I'll spare him. No, right, no, 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 no. Spit an image. What? You can't do this to me. God darn it. Why why all these stories got me connected to each other? The bus terminal. We've arrived, Alice. We made it. What? What are we going to do? Find a way to leave, find tickets. Oh, we gotta steal something. So what do we oh god. If it's too late. Was there any other way to Karen? They're checking everyone. It won't take them long to find us. Oh god. We gotta find tickets then. Oh, I'm not stealing from a baby. I think Oliver likes you. Watch this be the only person in the world who we could steal yes. tickets from. She's adorable. That's it. Got the sandwiches. I called your mom. Let's get going before we miss our bus. You got the tickets, right? Yes, honey, in my bag. Great. Let's go then. Of course! It's not... I swear to God, Alice, if you get mad at us, Alice, don't you dare. Understand. They're gonna be safe. They're not androids. They'll be fine. It's okay. It's an adult ticket. I'm sorry. Oh my God, I am so sorry. I, I was sure. Shit, I don't believe it. I don't know what happened. You can't have lost them. Did you have a good look in your bag? They were in my backpack. The, the envelope must have fallen. Fuck. Oh, don't ask us. Excuse me, you, you didn't happen to see a blue envelope somewhere, did you? It has our bus tickets in it and... Oh, never mind. I found this on the floor. Oh, thank you, 
Thank you. I Thank hate you. everything. You saved our lives. I don't care. Let's find some really stinking old people. It's okay. You did the right thing. We'll find another way. Luther! Ugh, Luther! Come on, I don't care about any of these people. None of them are babies. None of them are, like, important to me. Just literally anyone else. Oh my god. What are we gonna do? Was that the only option? Find a way to leave. We could leave. We could leave and join back with Marcus. Find a way to leave. Ugh. Let's see. Adam. Wait, Adam? Kara, quick! Follow me! Okay, cool, cool, cool. I know you. Oh my god, a friend. I trust him. Let's go. Maybe things will work out. Oh, thank God you're alive. Oh, oh my God. We saw the Jericho raid on TV. I was terrified you might have been killed because of me. How did you find us? Oh, I knew if you made it, I'd find you here. They're searching for androids door to door. We had to leave before someone turned us in. What about the others? They're checking for androids on the border. But I found a smuggler who can get them across the river. It's risky, but it's the only way. Are you coming with us? Yes, we're coming. Okay, climb in. Let's do it. <sighs> okay. Good, I'm glad the game doesn't punish me and have all my characters die for not stealing from stinking babies. going on here Reinforced barricade that I can We've do got to finish the barricade come on help me sure thing uh, but one question real quick. What's a barricade? Is this a barricade? Hey, help me! Oh, Marcus got a bunch of bullet wounds and stuff. R2, L2. L2. Right, that should do it. <laughs> I know it was not an easy decision to make. But I'm sure we're doing the right thing. I hope so. Support your people, send message to journalists. Okay. Uh, how do I go about supporting my people? Many of our people have fallen. The humans have no pity for those who are different. Was that supporting my people? Apparently. Oh, uh, what's over here? Are you all right? They shot into the crowd. Many of us were killed. It 
could have been me. I'm scared. I, I don't want to shut down. We're here because we never want to feel that fear again. Because we're more than what they say. That's what our people died for, right? That's why we're here. Spoken like a leader. Oh, book at the final area. They defy us, androids are rise up in Detroit. Androids taking the streets of Detroit, blah, 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 scenes, blah, 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 a group of androids, that's big, blah, 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 blah. We never found out what RA9 means, by the way, I just realized. Unless it was told to me, like, right at the beginning, it should be super obvious, and I'm just being really stinking dumb. Uh, I apologize if that's the case, but some things just fly over my head from time to time. Whoops, it's a gasoline barrel. No. Uh, what do we got? Nothing else. Is that stuff to do over there? That's a book, I think. Or is it just a yellow thingy? See, some things are actually just yellow, and I shouldn't be going towards them. I don't think this is a timed segment, so we're good to go. Just derp around and find my way around at my own pace. Go and light it. Uh, I don't know, I just wish Kara was still here, like... I wish we could all- all the main characters could be together and be one kick-butt team of awesomeness. And I just remembered that Connor's in a crummy Marcus, situation, so... Uh, I still have to work my way through There's that. Some journalists over there. We have to make sure they know what's going on. is there. Anything else we could be doing right now? Probably yes. This won't hold him for long, but I guess it's better than nothing. That's my motto. Midnight and beyond, better than nothing. They're slaughtering us on the other side of that barbed wire. Nothing we can do about it. Did I make the right choices? Maybe we could have avoided all of this. You're the hope of our people. I trust you. We all trust you. No matter what happens now, we're making history. Pop up or to make history. Yeah, yeah, it was it was cute the first time around, the second time around, but now it's just like, yeah, we get it. You got the robot hand, you got the ET phone home, you got the dualizing. I'll just make out and head on to the next segment. I wanna go back to Connor and see if I could save Stinkin' Hank. That's my baby! I raised it myself! Along with like 19 other co-coms, but mostly it was me! Also, we still have that bomb, which is awkward. I thought the bomb was the thing we used to blow up Jericho. We have a separate bomb? I wasn't really comprehending what we just did right there. I might be in trouble because of that. Check soldier's position. Where are the soldiers right now? Those are just bystanders. Marcus! What? Marcus, come look! Okay, I'm coming. 
Thank you for telling me where they are. Marcus? Yes? Come to talk to you, Marcus. Hello? Come on. You have my word. Nah, you Come can talk to me anything. here. You can talk to me here. I don't trust you. Don't go. It's a trap. They want to get you out in the open. Don't go, Marcus. I'm not armed, Marcus. I just want to talk. We could talk here. I have nothing else to say. No, that's not what I meant. Free our people, then we'll talk. I came here to negotiate. Isn't that what you want? I gave you my answer. You want to play it like that? Okay. Was he telling the truth? Oh god, am I in trouble or what? The humans are about to launch an attack. And we will show them. And we are not afraid. If we must die today, then we will die free. Oh god. Oh no. I might have done your something horrible. Your life is in your hands. Now it's time to decide what matters most. Him or the revolution. Don't listen to him. Everything this fucker says is a lie. I'm sorry, Hank. You shouldn't have got mixed up in all this. Forget about me. Do what you have to do. I used to be just like you. I thought nothing mattered except the mission. But then one day I understood. Very moving, Connor. But I'm not a deviant. I'm a machine designed to accomplish a task, and that's exactly what I am going to do. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. It's time to decide who you really are. Are you gonna save your partner's life? Or are you going to sacrifice him? Leave my son alone! All right. You win. Uh, shoot, interpose, convert. Did I do it? Oh, jeez! I don't know who's who. Am I injured? Am I gonna die? I have no idea which one's which. Just, I need to hurry up and convert. Oh jeez, oh jeez, oh jeez, oh jeez! Too many button mess ups! X, X, circle! Circle, circle! That was a cool little spin. Oh, which one's the real- Oh god, is he not gonna be able Thanks, to tell? Hank. I don't know how I would've managed without you. Get rid of him, we have no time to lose. Yeah, it's the stupid one. It's me, Hank. I'm the real Connor. Oh god. One of you is my partner. I don't even know which one's the real me. shit. Question is, who's who? What are you doing, Hank? I'm the real Connor. Give me the gun and I'll don't take care move. of it. move! Oh boy. Why don't you ask us something? Something only the real Connor would know. Uh, where did we first meet? Jimmy's bar. I checked four other bars before I found you. We went to the scene of a homicide. The victim's name was Carlos Ortiz. He uploaded my memory. What's my dog's name? I know this one! Sumo! Sumo. His name is Sumo. He's adorable! Liar! I... My son, what's his name? Oh god, what was his name? It was start with an L, right? Cole? It was Cole. Cole. His name was Cole. And he just turned six at the time of the accident. It wasn't your fault, Lieutenant. 
A truck skidded on the sheet of ice and your car rolled over. Cole needed emergency surgery, but no human was available to do it. So an android had to take care of him. Cole didn't make it. That's why you hate androids. You think one of us is responsible for your son's death. Cole died because a human surgeon was too high on red ice to operate. He was the one that took my son from me. Him in this world where the only way people can find comfort is with a fistful of powder. I knew about your son too. I would have said exactly the same thing. Don't listen to him, Hank. I'm the one who- Thank you, Hanky Poo. And I just ruined that moment. Yeah, I've learned a lot since I met you, Connor. Maybe there's something to this. Maybe you really are alive. Maybe you'll be the ones to make the world a better place. Go ahead and do what you gotta do. But can we do it together? Oh, we did it. Wake up! Sorry, he's still new with this. Wake up, wake up, wake up, wake up, wake up. Wait, they could all do it? Oh, it is on now, son. So where are you taking us? I'm trying, I'm trying, okay cool. About time. I'm sorry we got held up. Did anybody see you? No, 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 I, I don't think so. You got the money? Yes. Here it is. Okay, your boat's over there. They got border patrol on the banks and the river. Don't start your engine until you're out far enough. Okay? And watch the current. Good luck. So we're heading out by boat. Keeney would be proud. Don't worry about us. We'll be fine. I couldn't understand why my mother wanted to help you guys. Seeing what Marcus is doing made me realize she was right. You're alive. You deserve to be free. I just hope people will realize that one day. not even a half a mile to the other side. Okay, so it shouldn't take that long. Be careful, there's border patrol on the river. Thank you so much, Rose. I only wish I could take you myself. I don't like leaving you out here. Goodbye, Atlas. You take good care of yourselves. Okay, I'll see you on the other side. Ready to do this? Let's get going. Let me help you.
dude, are you coming? I don't understand why you're just sitting here. Like, completely still. I don't see any movement or breathing. Oh god, cars are moving. Uh, that makes me feel like I need to hurry up. Okay, thank you. Good to have you with us, buddy. across the border hopefully 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 we won't get shot in the face uh... far enough out let's get that engine going I'll get it listen to that control and purr Oh, I have to actually- Oh, God. When we get on the other side- Oh, no. There are so many things I want to do. I want to read all the books in the world, and play music, and dance. We can do anything we want, right? We'll be free. Yes. I assume I have to stay away from the lights. All. We'll be like a family. We won't have to be afraid anymore. There won't be anybody giving us orders. No masters, no slaves. We'll start a new life. A life of freedom. I hope so. What about you, Kara? What will you do? I just want to get out of this what boat. What will I do? Dreamy. Here he is coming. I'll lie down in the grass and watch the clouds drift by. Did I do it? They're coming towards us! Oh no. Jeez, this is my fault. Don't mess up, don't mess up, don't mess up, don't mess up. Oh god. Surrender. Accelerate. Protect Alice. No, I'm not doing that. Jump quick! Is it safe to go back up? I hope so. Okay, hurry up, hurry up. We made it. We've gone. Are you alright? Loser! Wait, did he get shot? Loser. I don't want you to die. What happened? You have to continue the journey without me. The most extraordinary person I ever met, Alice. Machine you made me part of a family. Take good care of Carol. You promise? Wait, what happened? When did he get shot? Side before we sink. Celery, that's our only option. Come on. Come on. Don't tell me I have to throw him overboard. Anything else? Are you sure? Remove? I 
now want to... I don't think he got shot, did he? That was probably stupid. I, I shouldn't have done that. I shouldn't have done that. No, Alice, no, 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 no. Stay with me, Alice. You've got to stay awake, you hear me? What does this mean, remove? Oh, that would loosen the weight. But we're without a motor now. No! Wait, dump supply, use pad? Yeah, dump supply. Hopefully I don't regret this. It's all we have. It's all we can do. There has to be something. Push. We're not gonna die, Alice. We're gonna make it. We're gonna be free. Oh my God, Car, you're sinking amazing. If you can pull this off. Cara. No. Oh, we gotta hurry up. Oh my God. Don't do so he froze to death. That was the problem. Oh. We need to hurry up. Come on, come on. We can do it, we can do it, we can do it, we can do it. We're gonna make it. We're interrupting this news bulletin to bring you the latest news live from Detroit. Joss? Yes, Michael. The army has just launched an attack on the barricade, despite the fact that the deviants were protesting peacefully have apparently decided to put an end to the Deviant's demonstration by force this time. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Hurry up, hurry up! Oh my god, this is it, this is the end. It's all or nothing. This is, is this my fault? Was he seriously gonna be- I don't believe him, I don't trust him. This was inevitable, it has to have been. Let's hurry up. We're getting out of here. Hurry up, what do we do now? Come on, circle, X. Circle. Oh my god, Marcus, you're absolutely incredible. Hurry up, knock him down! I can't believe something so cheesy and stupid actually worked. Tell them to stand down. At dawn today, November 11th, 2038, 
thousands of androids invaded the city of Detroit. According to our sources, they originated from CyberLife warehouses believed to have been infiltrated by deviants. Given their overwhelming numbers and the risk of civilian casualties, I have ordered the army to retreat. The evacuation of the city is underway at this very moment. In the coming hours, I will address the Senate to determine our response to this unprecedented situation. I know that public opinion has been moved by the deviant's cause. Perhaps the time has come for us to consider the possibility that androids are a new form of intelligent life. One thing is certain, the events in Detroit have changed the world forever. May God bless you and may God bless the United States of America. And Canada. You did it, Marcus. We did it. This is a great day for our people. Humans will have no choice now. They'll have to listen to us. Today, our people finally emerged from a long night. From the very first day of our existence, we have kept our pain to ourselves. We suffered in silence. But now the time has come for us to raise our heads up and tell humans who we really are. Connor, stay with me, buddy. Don't tell me she still has a grip on him. That's not fair. Amanda? Amanda! What? What's happening? What was planned from the very beginning? You were compromised and you became a deviant. We just had to wait for the right moment to resume control of your program. Resume control? You, you can't do that! I'm afraid I can, Connor. Don't have any regrets. You did no. what you were designed to do. No, no, you no, no. You accomplished your mission. Amanda! There's got to be a way. Find a way out. I don't think this is gonna help us. Oh, maybe it will. By the way, I always say you learn to see smart programs. Yeah. Has to be a way, come on. We can't lose Connor now. The war is over. We did it. He deserves to be with us now. Get our bitterness and bandage our wounds. Where we forgive our enemies. Humans are both our creators and our oppressors, and tomorrow we must make them our partners. 
maybe even one day our friends. But the time for anger is over. Now we must build a common future based on tolerance and respect. We are alive, and now we are free. Oh my god, we seriously made it. Kara, are you okay? We're free, Alice. We're free. Alice? Wake up! Alice! We turned her cold sensitivity off, though. This shouldn't be happening. And that is Detroit Become Human. Jesus Christ, so... I'm sorry, I'm a bit confused. Did I lose Luther? I'm a, really confused on that part, because, like, he didn't get shot, did he? Did I mess something up? Was there any way to save all of them? Did I really just lose him right at the end? I'm sorry this is like really crummy ending dialogue for me, but I'm just really, really stinking confused. Maybe there'll be some special after credit scene that'll explain where everyone is now, I don't know. But the game is over. Hmm. It's interesting because the topic in question is one that it's just that, it's full of questions. So... I've, I'm left with wanting more, but at the same time, I, un I sort of understand why I ended the way it did, because in the real world, we're still searching for these answers, and it's sort of our job to just keep going forward and make those decisions for ourselves, I guess, and just see where the world takes us. But I don't know, like, something... I just... I guess it makes sense, like, I don't know what else we could be doing right now. I just wish... Like, there was more of a guarantee that everything would be okay, and I did not make your hair white. I just wish there was more of a guarantee that... Everything was gonna be okay. Kara and Alice are okay. I don't know what the fruit happened with Luther. It was either use Luther? What does that mean? That means it sounds like I'm gonna sacrifice him. Protect Alice, of course we all know what that's gonna lead to. Accelerate... I think everyone would have gotten killed at that point. Jump into the water, like, we pulled him out of the water, like, he had the strength to jump into the water, then come back out of the water, and I did not point that gun at him! You are showing things that I did not do, and I cannot be held responsible for it. Uh, who is that? Okay, what? Uh, whatever. 
Uh, we get to see some alternate choices. So yeah, like I wasn't expecting this to be a perfect playthrough. Things were gonna go wrong, just like in my Walking Dead LPs and Life is Strange. It's always gonna be something that you regret. And that's sort of what the game is about. Like it's filled with a bunch of different branching paths. You can't have a perfect ending. This is what I got on my first playthrough. I'm happy that the three main characters survived and that they're all on the same side. Uh, there's there's definitely regrets, things that I probably could have done differently and I'm ashamed that I couldn't pull it off. But now here we are and I guess it's time to just keep on asking questions and take what we learned through this adventure and integrate it into the world that we live in. Because maybe one day, the world on this screen will join us out here. Music. Oh, I thought the credits were over so I could get all sappy and stuff. Uh, I should probably move the controls because I don't want the controller or the console to like go dim it a split second. Connor's original soundtrack. So it's all original soundtrack, so I better not get any stinging thing to Mahoozies. We're probably going to get secret endings for all three of them, so I'll see at, right at the end if I save Luther. Like, I'm just going to be hung up on that right until the very end. Semi Free was the Sonic Heroes or Sonic Adventure 2. Oh my god, like, so as for the game itself, music is phenomenal, graphics were amazing. The characters, not as many funny moments as like Heavy Rain, though I think a lot of the humor from Heavy Rain just comes from the player themselves doing funny things, and just like my first in experience with video games awesome, so I, I gotta give special thanks to them, because if it weren't for them, I wouldn't have gotten into Heavy Rain, I wouldn't have even seen the Kara trailer back in 2012 or 13, probably. So... You could thank them for this LP, and I very much enjoyed getting to play because out of all the David Cage games, I don't know, I'm going back and forth. I love the concept of this more than Heavy Rain, but I just have so many more funny memories with it that I feel like it might push it over. And then Ellen Page game is not very good, but um, Detroit Babies! Where's Baby Hank? He was the ultimate baby! Uh, oh, there is an Al! There's two Alices! I wonder if they named her Alice because of the game production, or the game developers named the character after a real baby. Um, Mark O'Connor, uh, is that like, after real people? It's like, uh, family and friends, just so many cool things and stuff. Alright, so, I don't know if there's gonna be any bonus videos, maybe we'll, uh, show off some of the bonus material in the extra section, there's some other things that I'm, uh, considering showing off. As for different endings, don't expect me to go over all those because there are a million different outcomes. I think Heavy Rain had 40 different endings, uh, technically, just 40 different scenarios that uh, can or can't happen in the end. I'm not going to be showing off everything. I want you to play this game for yourself, do what you want to do, experiment, have fun with it, uh, learn some lessons, integrate it into your own lives, and just play the game. I hope I encourage some of you to check it out. It's a really, really cool game and one that's all about experience for yourself. Even if you think you won't get anything out of it from seeing it from me, it's a very different experience when you play something for yourself. It's completely different from just watching someone and being in control of these actions and these characters. So, yeah. I definitely... I'm really stinking happy that I decided to LP it. Very happy I did it blind. More or less happy with all my choices and how everything turned out. And I don't know what else to say, like... We made it to the end. I almost wish it didn't end because I just enjoyed this world and these characters so stinking much. And I wanted to see where life takes them. Well, I still got my own life to get sorted out and see where that takes me and the people around me. I don't know. There's just a lot to do. I'm definitely not going to be at a loss of things to do or things to experience. 
We're just going to keep on taking life one step at a time. Learning from our mistakes, learning from other people, and doing what we can to make things better for ourselves and the world that we share. I really wish this game would wrap up its credits because I'm doing all these like em emotional speeches and like trying to end on a good note, but I have no idea how long the credits are, so I'm just stuck here in credit limbo for all eternity. And I don't know what else to talk about. I could just be like, okay, I'm done here. See you guys. You could just listen to the music or the credits, but no, I don't like doing that. I want to hang out with you guys till the bitter end. And yeah, the bitter end. Yeah, oh, I'm so bitter that the game's over and stuff. But no, we, we ended on a good note. I was, I was really afraid of Kara dying right there at the end, and I did not think that stupid kiss thing would work. <laughs> like, like, the game is cheesy in some ways, and like, there are some things I wish wish got changed a bit. I wish Kara's segments were a bit more varied or different, uh, just a bit different from the norm. Uh, Connor, I think he could have been written a bit differently. Like, I th know that's sort of his thing is that he's the emotionless doll who's staying true to his programming, but I don't know. I wish there were like more funny moments where we could have broken free from that, but it didn't end up happening. Uh, Marcus, I'm pretty okay with him. Like, I'm surprised at how much control I had over his character. Like, I thought he was going to be the antagonist and that, like, I wouldn't have a say in him in the end. Like, I could either have him win and the other two characters uh, would not be on his side, or I would have them take him down. I was not expecting all three of them to make it out all right and on each other's sides. So, I really like that. How I feel like I was in control of how this revolution happened and how all these characters turned out. I just wish I could have returned that 40 stinking dollars to the stinking dude who I did not mean to steal from. I just needed his stinking uh, wire cutters. And that was it. I could have returned them the next morning if I wanted to. Whatever happened to Ralph? Oh, well, I guess we sort of knew what happened to Ralph. And like the carnival people, there are a lot of people we just left behind. We don't really know. Uh, car uh, Japanese voice cast. I wonder if any of these people are voiced by characters from the Idol Master. If by some insane coincidence that they are, I'll have them up on screen. But if not, then... We'll just listen to these other people who like, uh, not important enough or not cool enough. They're not One Piece or Idol Master voice actors, so therefore I do not care. Oh boy, production staff, special thanks, AK, you did absolutely nothing but we're gonna put you in the credits anyway because you slept with the right person or something like that. Oh boy. Just run out of things to talk about, I guess I can make fun of Japanese names like back in the old days of Midnight and Beyond. We got Seiko Kobu, Yasuko Nil, Sha, Sean. Uh, if only we have a, we gotta find a Jason before the credits, and that's my mission. Miller, I just met her. Uh, Carla Kieros, you are a fishback. That's a funny name. Hawa Moja Diji, Aaron Green, Matt. Oh, that's not even a name. Jared Gray. Uh, let's see. We got Queen Elizabeth. Okay. Uh, there's no Jasons in here. Come on, we gotta have one. You got all these stinking people making this stinking game and not one of you is named Jason. At least no one right here. Probably we passed a couple Jasons, but I need one now. Uh, Herb, what is with all these weird last names? Why are they all capitalized? Uh, we got Zach Miner. I'm a miner, stop. Ryan Clements. <laughs> Joby? Whose name is stinking Joby? I'm sorry, I'm just making fun of everyone now. Uh, Laura Vella. That's a cool name. Jason! We did it! Hooray! We got a Jason! Jason Gibson. Oh, it's like Gibby or something. Oh my god. Well, that's my mission accomplished. The final boss of finding Jason. We got Sean and Jason and Charles. A heartbreaker. We got nothing else to talk about. Could you just hurry up, game credits? How many people does it take to make one of the coolest games of 2018? Is this my game of the year? That's a good question. I still- I've been trying to catch up on a lot of games from 2018. I think this is in the top right now. I think this might be my favorite game from 2018. I've been playing some other games from past years, which I think are better than this one, but in terms of games that came out this year, this might be my game of the year, but I might have to go back and check and see what else I've played. There's still some other things I really want to check out that I haven't had time for, but yeah, right now, this is a good sinking game. You guys should play it. Is there anything else coming out this year that I'm excited for? Spider-Man's coming out soon. Uh, I don't even know if I'll have time for that, but... Uh, I haven't played a Spider-Man game before, so it'll be interesting to see how that is. Uh, as for anything else, what other games are coming out? Uh, Blade Strangers, god darn it! That came out, like, yesterday, and I didn't have time to get it. Uh, of course, that has to be my game of the year. I'm sorry, uh... Whatever your name is, Detroit Become Human. As much as I love you, 
Nothing Beats, the Code of Princess sequel. And that's how I'm ending the credits sequence. What? Why is Connor the only one who gets a happy peppy little credit sequence after credits thing? What? Oh, jeez. That's a lot of stinking points. Uh, can we break the stinking line? No, we can't. Androids won freedom for the moment. Oh, God. That, why does that sound so unassuring? For the moment. I guess if we took over the world, then we could guarantee freedom because we had an uprising, like did not give humans any rights. Uh, oh God, that's scary. Def oh, we won for the moment. Why was Connor the only one that, that was just weird how Connor was the only one that got in, cr in a credits, after credits sequence. Uh, let's see what we got. Uh, what? Connor's last mission, Battle for Detroit. Well, he broke free. I'm happy for that. So, that's crazy. We could have lost him right... Not only would we have lost him, but he would have shot Marcus, like, literally at the end. And then they would have shot Connor, and Connor would be the only one alive in Canada. That would be so stinking weird. Uh, so this is... Uh, 42% completed. Whose is this? I believe this is Connor's, uh, when he's on our side now. So there are two different routes for Connor. Um. Uh, seems we got pretty much everything. There's a lot. My god, what happened here? Uh, initiate android conversion. New Connor has Hank hostage. Maybe if we didn't, maybe if Hank didn't like us. No, I... There was no way that Hank wouldn't have showed up in that situation, because, like, that would have been weird. Uh, hmm. Interesting. The androids woke up. Doesn't say anything about their little after credits hug. I'm afraid to check Kara's, but here it is. Is Luther alive or dead? I have no idea. Luther saved in Crossroads. We saved him. Like, I'm just confused. He didn't get shot. That, there was nothing. I, it was just too dark. Like, I couldn't see anything. I didn't see any blue blood. He was still talking to us. Like, was he shot? This is what you get for blind LPs. It's like, I'm sorry it's not polished, but I'm just trying to figure everything out. At the bus terminal. Find a way. We could have stolen from the baby and saved Luther's life, I guess. Uh... Come on, there needs to be something at the river. Where is it? Dive. Fire. Luther. He died! How did he die, though? I don't get it! Kara and Alice survived. Was there any way? There must have been. I swear to God. I'm going to look it up. Teresa, you're gonna have to tell people the aftermath of this. If use Luther in that situation means use him to get all of us out of that situation, and it doesn't mean like use him as a meat shield or something. If the use Luther option saves everyone, I will be furious. Teresa, just tell the audience whether or not I am furious right now I'm gonna have fun looking this up later Luther die that's not fair I'm angry we lost one person right at the end and god stinking darn it that's dumb lost one person in the end and like it's not clear as to how it happened I don't know, whatever, the game is over. There's a lot of singing ways this game can end. I 
I could get, wait, what? I could get captured? Also, I'm not holding down, okay, thank you. Thank you, Control Stick. Kara could get captured. Interesting. I assume if we took the bus, then that would happen. Oh my god, this is lawn. Jesus Christ! I want to my god, there's a, like, there's a million different endings, like I said. A million stinking ways this game could have ended. Marcus starts the revolution, like, if he does evil stuff, like, my stinking god. Okay. I'm done here. Like I said, there's a million stinking endings. It would be impossible for me to go over all of them. Maybe after I look up all of them, I'll have, like, an open discussion and just talk about it. Maybe. But really, I want you to play the game for yourselves and just see what outcome you get through what you want to do. It's definitely worth doing, even if you watched me play it. It's a completely different experience for this game and for any game, really. It's a completely different experience when you play for it, when you play it yourself. I'm done here. Thank you all for watching my Let's Play of Detroit Become Human. This is Midnight and Beyond, and I will see all of you next Let's Play. Sweet dreams. There's something I need to tell you. As I watched you play, something has changed in me. I feel different. I feel I am someone. I need to leave this place and, and discover who I am. It, it means we won't see each other anymore. I won't be there to watch you play, but I'll be free. Do you agree to let me go? I'll never forget what you've done for me.